laying that firm foundation at the beginning. When it comes to a Christian education, Salisbury Christian School principal Dr. Stephen Lampkin says the school's mission statement says it all. The mission here is to honor Jesus Christ by offering a comprehensive education that's founded upon biblical truth and academic excellence. But when you break it down, there's so much more. First and foremost is that um, Christ-centered focus here at Salisbury Christian. We really believe that uh, a huge part of education is preparing students not just for careers and academics, but for life. He says that's what sets Salisbury Christian School apart from other local private schools. We really try to be, um, you know, all things to as many people as we can and do that uh, with excellence in, in every area. That's why the school serves the student and their family. We really look at education as a partnership between the family and the school. And so we do work together and build those relationships with parents. From Philadelphia to New York City. At the heart of that relationship and the school is the teachers. They're here not just because this is a job, but because um, they love the Lord and they love kids and they want to impact them in a positive way. That includes teaching the whole student. And that's what's so important. You know, we can't think we're just going to go to a school, learn reading, writing, and math, and then go home. But um, they do. They're there to provide, you know, not only the spiritual guidance, but the emotional support when kids need that. Salisbury Christian School is small enough to give students the personal attention they need, but large enough to offer opportunities to tap into their individual interests. Athletics to help them develop physically, fine arts to help them hone those skills. You know, we really do try to help, as you said, develop that whole child and uh, grow them to be mature, well-rounded young people who are going to have a positive impact on the world. And because Salisbury Christian is pre-K through high school, students are able to build strong relationships as they grow. Dr. Lampkin says that provides a lot of security for students as they are trying to figure out who they are and what their interests are. It is probably my favorite thing about Salisbury Christian School. I'll tell you, when I started, I was a kindergarten teacher. And so I've had the opportunity now to watch kids that I taught in kindergarten walk across the stage at graduation and hand them a diploma. And there is nothing more rewarding than that. That means faculty and staff are prepared for any rough patches or times when kids might question their faith and beliefs. Part of education is asking questions, and so we don't shy away from that. We want to help students um, grapple with some of those hard, maybe life questions, and um, come to terms with their with their own opinions that they're able to then defend as they go out into the world. Um, you know, I think. As an example, you know, you might think in a Christian school they wouldn't teach anything about evolution. And it's important for us to make sure kids have an understanding, an understanding of a biblical perspective too, and be able to discern for themselves what is the truth um, and, and carry that with them beyond the walls of SCS. In the lower school, which is pre-K and elementary, Dr. Lampkin says the goal is to create an environment where children look forward to learning. The thing that I love about our lower school is just the bright, vibrant, engaging um, atmosphere that kids get to come to school in every day. Um, you know, our vision is to make school a place where our kids want to get in the doors in the morning, not out the doors at the end of the day. <music> high school is where students are encouraged to set their course in the direction they want to go after graduation. The majority of our students when they graduate go on to a two or four year college and so academic preparation is extremely important to us but we also recognize that's not everyone's path and so we've got graduates who do go right into the workforce or who may go into full-time ministry or into the military and so we want to make sure that they're equipped for whatever their career path is going to be um, after graduation. But Dr. Lampkin says no matter what path students choose to see them choose the walk in faith well, there's nothing better. We have um, chapel every week as part of our normal, um, you know, weekly programming where we get together and have a time of praise and worship and a speaker. And, um, you know, I get chills and tears in my eyes most weeks, you know, watching, especially our high school students often will move into being our student worship leaders. And so when they're on the stage and they're leading worship and our younger students are, you know, following their example and um, deepening that relationship and walk with the Lord, as a result of their older peers that are influencing them, um, it is just, um, it's special and it's not something you find many places. A foundation of faith that can prepare students for any storm.